of more breaking news we're following this morning. Multiple emergency crews are on the scene of a capsized boat right now along Priest Lake. News Channel 5's Blake Rosnowski arrived at the scene just a few minutes ago at Long Hunter State Park. And Blake, do we know if anyone was in the boat at the time that it capsized? Well, I just talked to some folks at the Office of Emergency Management, and that's exactly what they're trying to figure out at this point. You can see we still have lots of crews here on scene. And if you take a close look, you can still see that boat capsized and pretty much underwater at this point. The little red spot is actually the gas tank that's still attached to it. But we want to give you a look at what it looked like just a few hours ago when Sky 5 first arrived on the scene. You can see there that the water is lapping up against it. You can see that that boat is obviously overturned. So now the question is whether or not somebody's actually inside. This originally came out as a call for possibly a boat crash. We were told by OEM here that a man and his daughter showed up here at this boat launch in Long Hunter State Park and they saw the boat overturned. However, there's actually no other vehicles in the parking lot, so it's really unclear at this point whether or not somebody else was here. They obviously didn't launch from here because there was no vehicle here, but that's not to say that they couldn't have launched from somewhere else. At this time, though, they do say that they have not received any calls for a missing person either. So all of that still under investigation. Divers are about to get into the water to go through everything and try to see if anyone may be under there. So, of course, stick with us on you know, News Channel 5 and, of course, on NewsChannel5.com. We'll give you those updates as soon as we know more. For now, live at Long Hunter State Park, Blake Rosnowski, News Channel 5.